Good evening, one and all. I'm Video Game Girl 64, and I'd like to get some stuff out of the way before I begin. So, first of all, I want to try and put sound, like the actual video game music, in the video now. So, if you hear music at the moment, that means I was successful with syncing up the video and the sound properly. If it's still silent in the background, well, you know how that went. Also, I'm trying to get out of the habit of using the spacebar. I feel like this Let's Play has gone by way too quickly because I'm always holding down the spacebar whenever I can. So I'm trying to get out of that habit, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. So, yeah, our team looking fabulous like always. And uh, we have to do one of my least favorite things in this game. We have to go to this place. I hate this, what is this, like the Silk Code Tower or whatever. I don't know. But I, I hate, I, I've always hated coming through here because I always get lost, never know what to do and where to go. There's so many rockets to fight and most of them are like stupid. Hey kid, what are you doing here? And then we get into a battle and it, it's just something that I don't prefer to do. Like, look at this, he probably has like a gold bat and like five Zubats, and they're ten levels under me. Like, what am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to enjoy this? Look at this. Look at this. Ugh, right when I want to get out of the habit of using the space bar, I run into a trainer that has like five Pokemon that are all ten levels below me. More than ten levels, that's twelve levels be below me. Ugh, <sighs> okay. Uh, really, like, the rockets, I think, for Pokemon Red and Blue, Team Rocket was, like, I mean, the concept of having an antagonist in this game, like, besides your rival, having, like, a group of people to defeat, I think that was a good idea, but, like, they just made Team Rocket so bad. Like, there's always memes and jokes going around about, Oh, Team Rock, yeah, we're so strong. We use Rodaton, Zubat, like, what? Like, you'd expect better from, like, a team of evil bad guys, you know? They're supposed to be strong and threatening, not Raticates using Tail Whips, and it, it, it didn't even work. Tail Whip didn't even work. Like, you know what I'm talking about, right? I think... Most people, if not all people, can agree with me when I say the Team Rocket was, like, not planned out that well, like... They should have spent more time thinking about and planning Team Rocket because, you know, it's, it's just too easy. That's just too easy. You goofed, yes, you, you did goof. <clears throat> Alrighty now, let's see. I don't really want to fight everybody. I just want to like get all the items or most of the items and fight Giovanni and be on my way. You know, I don't want to go through all these battles. I'm trying to find like a key or a card key or something. I don't know. There's always too much to do in this building. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to fight that guy, aren't I? Yeah, I'm gonna have to fight that guy. <sighs> Alrighty, let's make it quick. Quit messing with us, kid. Who do you think you are? You're just generic, g generic rocket with a radicate. At least it's a higher level than the other guy's radicate. I can give you props for that, but you're still not saying much. Well, Psychic looks so trippy. Oh my god! Oh, I didn't do that much, okay. Mega Drain! Yeah, I wish they had Giga Drain in this game. I don't know, Mega Drain just is too weak for Buttercup. Buttercup deserves better. What am I gonna use? I'll use you. I'm assuming you're faster than a level 28 Hypno. Just want you to kill it. Just get in there, you're gonna drill peck it, and you're gonna kill it, right? 
That's what I'm expecting from you. That's your expectation. Oh, right. Critical hit, too. You know how to impress me, Derpy. Alright, we've got like eradicate. Um, let's let Tank take care of this one. Making sure like everyone gets some action this episode. Kicking some Team Rocket butt. So everyone's gotta get in on this. Everyone's gotta kick some of Team Rocket's butt. You know? It's just one group activity that we all join together and we do like a one big happy family. Alright, defeated the rocket. Uh, you don't fight me, do you? No, you don't. So... I don't know where to go. I never know where to go. Like, no matter how many times I play this game, I never knew what to do. Like, I, I never know what to do in this building. I don't understand. I'm always lost. Ugh. I don't want to fight everybody. There's too many people and I'm too strong. Uh, I don't get how people like grind in this game. Why, why would anybody need to grind in this game? Like I've never had to grind in like any Pokemon game I've played, like ever. It's probably a lie, but I don't grind often or ever. You know, it's just not on my to-do list. It's not something I look forward to doing, it's not something I need to do. Especially now, considering, like, Team Rocket's stupid and my Pokemon's levels are so much higher. Like, I don't, I don't understand. Who designed it like this? Who designed it like this? That's what I want to know. That's what I want to know. Because, like... Come on. I still can't get over how, like, pussy Team Rocket is. I mean, like, bad guys in other video games, they're scary, and then there's Team Rocket, and like, they don't even threat- they're not even threatening. Like, you see them, you don't think, oh no, I'm gonna die. You see them and you think, oh no, I have to battle them, what a waste of time. You see that difference there is? There's a big difference there. And I still don't know where I'm going, or where I'm supposed to go, or what I'm supposed to do. I think if I go down here, this looks familiar. Yes, I go here, then I go back on here, and I'm gonna have to fight that guy, aren't I? Look away! Fine, I'll fight you, jeez. <clears throat> Alrighty, Rocket wants to fight, Rocket sent out Arbok. Alright, well, I, I think this is your only Pokemon on. I wasn't paying attention. I don't like to pay attention to you guys. You guys are boring. You guys are wasting my time. I just want to go up and fight Giovanni with all these other people who aren't important or in the way and Buttercup are level 48 because I love my Buttercup so much. Butterfree is like the best Pokemon in my books. And you know, out of all 649, I think that's how many there are. Yes, the card key. Out of all 649 Pokemon, there is always that one, or those like select few, that are like better than any other Pokemon you think of. Whether it be like Rayquaza, who like is awesome and has amazing stats and is a legendary Pokemon, or Mewtwo, which fits under the same category, <clears throat> or whether it's like a stupid Pokemon, like. Butterfree or Chikorita, that is just, that's your Pokemon, and that Pokemon, to you, is worth more than any other you can think of. And oh my god, it's, what, what's up? What's up, Nurse Joy? What are you doing in here? Cool. Now that was pretty cool. Alright, I think that means I'm close, because I remember her being close to, um, the place I'm supposed to go to, and I have to fight you, don't I? Yes, I do. Okay. Pokemon seem to adore you, kid. Oh, come on. Everybody adores me. If you've seen me, I'm such a little cutie. I'm like the cutest thing alive. Or maybe that's just me being a narcissist. I don't know. Maybe I'm actually ugly, but I think I'm like the cutest thing ever. That'd be sad. <laughs> <sighs> My mom says I'm cute. Okay. Carrying on. 
critical hits. I like that. Tank knows how to impress me. Oh, uh, the grime. I'll keep out Tank. You have dig. <laughs> Grimer looks so derp. I love it. Look at that face. Just look at that face. Come on. How could you look at that face and say that that's ugly, that you don't like that? I, I look at that face and I'm like, that's adorable. I don't know, maybe things that look derp are just, like, adorable to me and me only, and everybody else thinks that, like, derp-looking things look stupid. I think derpy things look cute. Like, derpy! Derpy's adorable! Like, I never realized how cute Doduo was ever since I caught one. Like, ever since I caught Doduo, I've been, like, looking at it differently. Like, it just looks so cute to me now. Like, oh my god. Is it just me? Am I the only one that thinks Doduo looks cute? I think it's just me, but I don't care, cause... My opinion, everyone else can like GTFO. Okay. <clears throat> Haven't really gotten many items, and- ooh. This is where I'm supposed to go, okay. I just want to walk around a bit more. I think this is floor 3? I don't know, what floor is this? What floor am I in? I have to remember this floor for the rest of my life. Every time I play this game, I'll have to come to this floor. What floor am I on? Oh wow, the elevator moved a lot. I don't think I was on floor 3. I, I was on floor 3? So fuck that elevator. Just to make sure, this is where I was. Okay, floor 3. I now have a- I now have a reference. Whenever I play this game, and I want to get out of here, and I want to finish whatever I'm doing, just go to floor three. Floor three is the key. Okay. Let's go to floor six. What's on floor six? Fancy elevator. <clears throat> oh my god, I don't wanna talk to you. I don't know what I'm doing. I wanna press the space bar so badly. Controlling my urges. I don't want to battle you either. Oh my god, items. You see, I knew there was a lot of items in here. And there is a specific one I want. An HP up, that's not really what I was looking for, but whatever. It's pretty cool. Like, it's accuracy, that's stupid. Okay. I'm gonna toss this because, like, I, I hate these items. I'm going to... Use this HP up on Matt because, like, you know, Snorlax and kind of bulky and whatever. Um, don't know where I am, but I'm just looking for some items now. Like, I'm trying to avoid these people to the best of my ability because all I want to do now, like, I just want to find some items. I could care less about anything else that this building has to offer. I know I have to go to floor three. It's just right now I'm looking for some items before, like, I get out of here. Because if I remember correctly, there's this one really good TM in this building. And I want to teach it to one of my Pokemon. I was just here. But I've got to find that TM first. Like, I can't, like, leave it here. Like, I'd feel so terrible. <clears throat> okay. Oh my god. I'm here again. I don't want to be here. Go up one. Alright in here. It's in this room. An item! TM3. That's not the TM I'm looking for, but let's see what TM it is. Swords Dance. Hmm. No one can learn it. Okay, I guess I'm not gonna learn it then. Thanks, game. For crushing my dreams. I don't wanna talk to you. I don't wanna talk to anybody. I just wanna go through. I don't want to talk to you, but I do want this item over here, the calcium. That increases special attack, correct? I hope so. So I am going to use this calcium on Buttercup. Yes, special. Oh, special attack, special. Forgot there's no special defense in this game. Uh, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> oh ho, I smell a little rat. You're a little rat. 
That's so rude. You don't just go and call people little rats. Okay, we got to eradicate here. I got my Blastoise. I'm obviously going to win because I'm just going to surf its face. Yeah. That surf attack. That beautiful, beautiful animation. I'm liking it. Oh, I'm level 38 now. What? You got nothing on me. You've got nothing on my tank. We gonna dig now. And we gonna hit you. And gonna be super effective. And I'm gonna switch to Celestia and give her some action because she's been she's been waiting for some action. I'm gonna use I'm gonna use body slam. Yeah. And you wanna use smog, but guess what? I can't be poisoned, so uh yeah, you're stupid. Bubble bean. Yay! Alright. This is going well. Got gold bat, I'll stay out. And I'll um I'll just slide some rocks on it. You know, cause th that's what you do to people to greet them, right? You just slide some rocks on them. That seems pretty ethical to me. Okay. Red defeated rocket. Lights out. Alright. Um you are gonna go here. So we got Matt up first. Bingo! The card key, open the door. What do you have to say? It's really dangerous, you came to save me, you can't. Bitch, you doubted me? Are you doubting me? Okay, so, all you guys have nothing important to say, so I fought that rocket for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Thanks for that. Thank you so much for that. Okay, I, uh, I don't know where I am. I don't know if I fought that guy. I'm not gonna take any chances. I think I fought you, but I'm not, not taking any chances. No chances here. No chances are allowed to be taken. When the card key open the door, and I enter. And I'm hoping that there's no one here to battle me, and I don't trust you. So I can't trust people. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> What's the point of that? Okay. That was useless, and there's a scientist there, but I don't want to battle him. There's a scientist here, I don't want to battle him either. Oh my god, I just want to find that TM. That's like the only reason why I'm actually exploring this place. why I'm tired, but... Yeah. <laughs> I did, like, almost nothing today. You know, I should be doing my homework, but I'm just sitting here recording instead, because, like, that's what a responsible to Fuck. Ugh. I don't care if you're one of the four Rocket Brothers. But, yeah, and, um, instead of doing homework, I'm just chilling here. Playing some Pokemon Red, fighting like these stupid rockets that are all stupid because they're all weak and Team Rocket sucks. And I'm just gonna use Amnesia a few times, I'm gonna get confused. And Matt's gonna hit himself because Matt's confused. Or not, okay. That's cool, that's cool. I'm gonna use Thunder and it's gonna hurt, like, a lot. But yeah. What do I even have for homework? Um... Gotta think of all my classes. I have a project for genocide class due on this Wednesday. Um, you see, I'm currently recording this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Red on November 4th, but I probably won't have it out till like the end of this week or like the beginning of next week or something. But yeah, my genocide project, which I only have very, very, very extremely rough notes for. Like, the, I have very vague rough notes for this project, and to do this Wednesday. So that's no good. I should have brought that home, so I should have worked on it. Oh, whatever. Probably do it tomorrow. Might do it the night before. I don't even know. And then, 
I have to write a journal for drama class. Which I think it's stupid. Like, I... Like, as much as I love writing about, like, myself and my feelings, I hate writing journal. Like, ugh. Journal writing is just something I prefer not to do. And then, um, I have this project for media class. Where I'm grouped with a bunch of people and we have to work on this project. And, like, oh my god, I walked right into that one. No, you're silly. You're silly. Don't call me silly. I'm not silly. Ugh. But yeah, we have this project for media where we have to make a video and it has to be two to- not two to four. It has to be three to four minutes long. But ours is only two minutes long. Well, two minutes and two seconds. Plus 15 seconds for intro and credits. So we got like two minutes, 17 seconds worth of footage. And, like, that's terrible. Our teacher's, like, gonna eat us or, like, deduct marks for that or something. And, like, for the past, not last week, but the week before that, my group stressed me out so much. Like, I was ready to cut them. All my group members are just stressing me out. But now I'm not stressed anymore. I'm, I'm mellow. I'm calm and relaxed and cool. And I'm playing some Pokemon Red because, yeah, I love this game. Sorry for the little jump there, I got rudely interrupted by my mother. <clears throat> oh well, at least she knocks. My brother doesn't even knock on the door anymore, he just kinda like barges in. It's very rude. Alright, that Machoke looks pretty derp to me. Like, look at it. oh my god, look at those eyes. It's so derp, okay. Um... Celestia, you take care of this. Haven't seen some action from you in a while. That's a lie. <laughs> we saw action from everybody so far. Um, let's go for a body slam. That seems pretty legit. Oh, I didn't do that much. Well, my choke special is like shit, so let's try a bubble beam, see how much that does. Eh, about the same. Ah, stop it! Doing a lot of damage. Alright, Red defeated Rocket. What was I even talking about before, like, I had to pause the recording for a bit? Oh, I was talking about schoolwork. Oh yeah, my media project. Yeah, but that's not important right now. Um... Maybe my item's in here and then I can leave. Carvos, it's pretty good. That's not what I was looking for. Rare candy. Nice, nice. TM26! Ah, oh, This is what I wanted. Okay. What are the items I got? I got a Carbos, I got rare candy, and I got... Okay, just making sure. So, Carbos is speed, and uh, you need speed. And now, TM26, the almighty earthquake. We will be teaching this to the almighty Celestia. Yes, we finally have a ground type move to work with. Uh, goodbye Poison Sting. And hello Earthquake. I'm liking this. Alright, so um, I'm gonna make our way out of here now. Just moving on out. And we're going to go to, um, floor three, and we're going to do all the shit we need to do. Okay. Exit. We're, um, going to travel along here. Going to teleport right here. And bam! Okay, so we go there and Blue's all like, what kept you, Red? Ha ha ha. I thought you'd turn up if I waited here. I guess Team Rocket slowed you down. Not that I care. I saw you in Saffron, so I decided to see if you got better. Well, I did indeed get better. And I've always have been and always will be better than you. 
And what do you know, I just see- I just happen to have my brand new electric type up front, so uh... I shall now use Thunderbolt on your Pidgeot. And finally, respectable Pokemon levels. Like, you're not like Team Rocket with like, Pokemon 10 levels below mine, like you actually have levels that I can respect. We got Gyarados, you're staying out there. Yeah. And this is obviously going to take you down in one hit because it is four times super effective. So for some reason, Gyarados is flying type. I know why Gyarados is flying type, but I think they should have changed it after Generation 1. Like, Generation 2 and onward, this should have been Dragon Water, but I'm, I'm not going to get into that. We got Growlithe, so I'm just gonna send out my tank. Because, like, you know, giant turtles take on puny puppies. Yeah. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm so lame. I don't know what to say. I'm just kind of spurting out random stuff. I even started, started talking about school and homework and whatnot, and I didn't finish listing my homework. But I got, like, some math shit to do. I have this teaching course I'm in. I have to, like, write some stuff for that. And that's stupid. Alakazam. Hmm. Send out Matt. And I'll use Amnesia. So, like, the attacks won't do as much. And then I'll use Body Slam. Because Alakazam has no defense whatsoever. And for some reason you're using Confusion instead of Psychic. And you got a critical hit, but it's not fair. Because, like, critical hits don't count amnesias in the, like... Like, if, if you get a crit, stat changes don't count, so that's that's not fair. We have Venusaur, and we're gonna send out Buttercup, because... Butterfree Quad resists Grass-type moves. But I could also hit it with some Psychics. Yeah! Ain't that Coolio? <laughs> oh god, I just said Coolio. That's awful. Okay. Oh no, I'm poisoned! I'm gonna try using Swift, see how much of that does. Come on, kill it, kill it, yay! It's, if Swift didn't kill it, I'd be... I'd be quite upset. Oh ho! So you are ready for Boss Rocket? Yes, I am ready for Boss Rocket, Giovanni. Alright, you're not important. Although I love you, you're annoying me right now. I just want to fight Giovanni. Okay, thank you. Strut on out of there. Smell me later. Maybe talk to this dude. He is quite a nice guy. He, he actually gives you a Lapras. And I'm going to call you, like, um... I'm gonna call you... The S... S... N. Yeah, so uh, we'll get sent to box one. Lapis is intelligent and rare, you can't even catch it in the game. The only way to get one is for this guy to give one to you. Or if you trade one from a second generation game, I'm gonna use some lemonades. One on Matt, one on Celestia, and hopefully I have like an antidote or something to give to Buttercup because I don't want Buttercup to sit there and suffer from poison. It just breaks my heart. Oh, I do have a few antidotes, so I shall use one. Even though I might not use Buttercup during the next battle, I, can, I, I still love Buttercup, so it's okay. <sighs> Alright. We're almost there. Oh my god. Really? They, they just had to throw someone there, you see? I'm, I'm totally ready to go and fight Giovanni. I'm prepping my Pokemon. I'm like preparing for this, and you give me this rocket to fight with a stupid Cubone. Well, bubble beam your Cubone. Yeah. Drowsy, and I'm gonna switch out to my tank. This tank can take anything because he's a tank. Obviously. So I'm going to Mega Punch the Drowsy. 
and do a lot of damage, but sadly not kill it. And I don't know what to say because I thought I was gonna go fight Giovanni. No, this guy's in the way. This, this guy so rudely interrupt everything. He just wants to be the center of attention. He's all like, "Oh, you wanna go fight Giovanni? Well, I am here, and you have to fight me instead." Like what? Excuse me, princess, but this isn't all about you, you know. Just saying. Alright. Moving on up. Bingo, the card key opened the door. And now, we meet again. The president and I are discussing a vital business proposition. Oh, fancy words you're using. Keep your nose out of grown-up matters or experience a world of pain. Bring it on, Giovanni! Bring it on! Yeah. So we got Nito Reno. That's pussy shit. Cause you know what? I have Earthquake now. Yeah, my screen is shaking. Bet yours is shaking too. The screen's just shaking cause I got Earthquake. Yeah. Level 38. Got Kangaskhan. I shall switch out to... Derpy. Because why not? I don't know who else to switch out to. Alright. Drill pack time. Oh, so close. Really? Rage? Of all moves you have, like, of, of all the moves to choose from, you have Rage? Okay. Whatever. You can sit there and rage all you want because I just killed you, so I I'd be raging too. Rhyhorn, this will be a job for Tank. He's gonna use an epic surf attack. And take out this Rhyhorn, no problem. Get to level 39. And last, but definitely not least, because you know I have one too, it's a Nido Queen! Oh my god! Is that what Celestia looks like? From the front? She looks so pretty. But I'm going to have to annihilate the Nido Queen with my butcher cup. Really? You still have poison sting? Well, I have up- Poisoned. When I have upgraded from poison sting to earthquake, so your milkshake loses. No one's gonna understand that joke. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, you lost and you gave me money, so that's good. And now if I go up and I talk to this guy, he's all like, thank you for saving Syl. I want to something, 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 I can't read properly, so I'm just gonna skip this text and then... Hey guys, you want Master Balls? Oh my god, Master Balls. Yeah, and um, Team Rocket's gone, so Tank is gonna dig through the building. Tank's gonna dig up. And we're gonna land all the way. Why did I land here? Why did. What? Um. That's not what I wanted to happen. <laughs> Heal my Pokemon, please? Okay, well, we'll need your Pokemon. Alright, I'll take my Pokemon and heal them up. Hmm. My Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. I hope to see you again, too. And we're just gonna actually use our bicycle for once and make our way back to um, Saffron because that was stupid, but I just did what happened. Oh my god. That's not where I want to go. Yeah, I'll just end the episode here. I'll find my way back another time. So. In this episode, we took out the rockets in the Sylph building. 
And next episode, we're probably gonna take on Sabrina. Teenage Witch. No? Okay. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. This has been the first episode where I haven't pressed the space bar to speed up. And hopefully the first episode that has actual video game music. Woohoo! Alright, this has been Video Game Girl 64. I am over and out.